Okay, boys and girls, today we will be exploring the different sounds for the letter Y. Windy, sky, funny, fly, cry, muddy. Usually, when we are talking about what sound the letter Y says, we are thinking about the sound that Y says when it's at the beginning or middle of a word. Here are some examples of the usual letter Y sound. Yes, yum, yak, yet, you, yarn, yard, yell, year, yellow, yawn, yo-yo. At the beginning of each of these Y words, Y says y. But sometimes Y says I. Let's explore some words where Y says I. At the beginning of this word, we see F and L, and they say fl. And Y says I. Fl, I, fly. At the beginning of this word, T and R say tr, and Y says I, tr, I, try. I will try my best. At the beginning of this word, S K says sk. And Y says, I, sk, I, sky. Look at the bright blue sky. At the beginning of this word, W H says, W. And Y says, I, W, I, Y. Why are you so happy? So, when Y is at the end of a short word, it says I. Let's look at that list again. Fly, try, sky, Y. Each of those words ending in the letter Y is short. And so, the Y will say I. But sometimes Y can say E. Let's explore some words where Y says E. The base word in this word is rain. R-A-I-N spells out the word rain. And then the letter Y at the end says E. Rain, E. Rainy. It is rainy outside. The base word here is sleep. And then the Y says E. Sleep, E. Sleepy. I am sleepy and ready for bed. Sleepy. The base word here is mud. Mud, E, muddy. Those puddles are so muddy. This word, we have a base word in it that says stick. S-T-I-C-K, stick. And then the Y says E, stick, E. Sticky. That honey made my hands all sticky. So when Y is at the end of a longer word, it says E. Let's review that list again. Rainy. Sleepy. Muddy. And sticky. Each of these words 
is a little bit longer, and so the Y at the end says E. Let's review. When a word is shorter and has Y at the end, the Y sounds like I. When a word is longer and has Y at the end, it will sound like E. Let's try out some different words and see if we can sort them into the correct boxes. Is this a longer or shorter word? Will it say happy or happy? This is a longer word, so it says happy. It sounds like E at the end. Let's try another word. This one is shorter. Which box do you think it's going to go in? Does the Y sound like I or does the Y sound like E? Is this the word B I or is this the word B E? If you said by, you would be correct. It sounds like I. Let's try another one. Which box do you think this word goes in? Will it say sh i or sh e? It says shy because it's shorter, so the y sounds like i. Next word. This one is longer. Is this going to go in the same box as by and shy? Or will this go in the same box as happy? This is the word penny. So it goes in the same box as happy. Both of those words end in, a, end in an E sound. Next word. Is this going to match with by and shy? Yes, it does. This is the word my. Last word. This one is longer. Do we think this word is going to match in the sounds like I box or in the sounds like E box? Let's try sounding it out. L, A, K, I or L, A, K, E. Luck I or lucky? It's definitely the word lucky. Great job, boys and girls. Just remember, if it's a shorter word with Y at the end, it's going to sound like I. And if it's a longer word with Y at the end, the Y is going to sound like E. By, shy, my, happy, penny, lucky. Now, boys and girls, you can do it.